Hello and in this video I'm going to show you how to sign Wonder Kids on Football Manager before the big clubs actually get to them. I have a couple of players even from the 2023 youth intake and also French Wonder Kids. I'm going to show you how to get a lot of these players into your scouting range and have them on your list so you can actually go ahead and sign them as easily as you want. Now there are a number of ways to actually do this but you need to also know something that's really important. If the player is below the age of 18, let me just look at this Mafud Arabi. For example, he's currently 18, so the game will not actually tell you that this guy is a wonder kid. But if you look at a player that is above the age of maybe 19, 20, 21, he's in the, he's in the age of 21, you know that the game is at that point is actually going to tell you that this player is a wonder kid or not. So we're going to start off with the easiest method, which is using the media description. I'm just going to go ahead to players under the scouting column by the way go ahead to players instead of using scouted players you're going to use players in range so it's going to show you all the players within your scouting range or wherever even if you haven't scouted them before what you want to do is to go over to the column here and just right click on that column you're going to see insert column go over to insert column and then you should be able to find the media description now under the general tab okay there we are media description go ahead and throw that in there and then try to filter the players by their media description now you can see that 15 year olds 15 to 16 year old they all have media description either fullback or young center back but you can filter this by their alphabetical order media description we have attacking fullbacks at the beginning and then push it all the way to the end so you can see young winger you want to filter this down to players that say wonder kids so we're still looking at young winger young midfielder we have to go all the way up now there are a lot of players actually come through about 24,000 players but if you just keep scrolling down you can see the media description for wonder kid okay the age is 19 so the player has to turn 19 before the game can actually tell you that he's a wonder kid if or if they are below 19 let's say at the age of 18 you can't actually tell but in this video i'm going to show you how to find those players that are below the age of 19 that eventually will become wonder kids when they turn 19 so you can see all these players so you can go ahead and sign in some of them play for clubs like Boca juniors you can also see players that play for Palmerias, the players that have already joined Man City or Liverpool, you can try to avoid them as possible. But like I mentioned, I'm going to show you how to sign those players that have not yet joined the big clubs like Man City or Liverpool before they actually turn 19. So you can go ahead and sign them and they will be at your club. Now that's it for the media description. The next method I like to use is to use the player attributes by age. It's what I like to call the age ratio player attributes. Now notice that I already have it set to 15 and 20. We're going to narrow this down a little bit. Let's say we're looking for a player that is like a roaming playmaker in central midfield, all right? So go ahead to select roaming playmaker as attributes for those players. 15 is a bit high for a wonder kid. The ability or the attribute 15 should be a player that is like a top level. But if you see a player that is like below the age of 18 that has attribute 15, it means he's an absolute monster of a wonder kid. But let's just tone it down a bit to let's say the value of 10, 12. And then you're going to drop the age to like 16 and then once you have that you're going to filter it down to players that have um yeah like yeah like down to 1500 players so i'm just going to push this up to like 13 and then click ok you see nobody else goes on to appear so we're going to now try to let's say tone this down to 12 and see how many players show up nobody's still showing up you can change the matching value here to see how many attributes you actually want to match for roaming playmakers i'm just going to turn it down to 15 again and then we have a list of three players 16 year old one is currently playing at empoli the other is at barcelona b the other is at inter milan these are all legit wonder kids eventually when they turn six or when they turn 19 they will be wonder kids that's because they have attributes that are already world class even at a young age like 16 so the barcelona guy may be a bit expensive looking at the value but the guy at Empoli might not be so expensive. So you can actually go ahead and sign this guy that is at Empoli, a Brazilian, Gabriel. You can go ahead and sign him for like 45k if you want. And before he even joins the bigger club, you've got him on your hands. Now the next method I like to use is the national teams. And that's kind of what I used for France. When I even look at my scouting, if you look at my scouting shortlist, it's basically French players because I'm using Monaco. I don't want to sign other players. I have to have registration problems. I don't know how serious the registration problem is in the French league but most of these players they're all French players so in case I'm looking for a player that I want to sign it has to be French so you can see a lot of these players they come from the national team so what you like to do is to go into the world as the globe that you see at the top here click that option go over to the world under the world tab go over to either the under 20 world cup or the French youth international let's say I'm not limiting myself to France now I want to look at other countries as well just go over to the world cup you can see England the current holders and they also have Argentina and you can just let's say we're picking Argentina for example you can go over to Argentina and then select the under 19 squad and look at the players that are listed in the under 19 squad 
at a point in football manager these players will be grayed out so you have to pay attention to when the international window is coming up when they actually ask you which matches or which of your players are going to play in international football some players are going to res represent their country try to pay attention to those dates and then come back to the national team let's select the under 20 or the under 19. when you see all the players listed there just select all those players at once and then go ahead and right click and under the report tab scout those players for one week you're going to have fair knowledge of players that the game already decided are good enough to represent a national team at a young age you can go ahead and scout those players and when you do scout them you have a lot of incoming reports so you need to go over to your shortlist i recommend creating a shortlist and adding those players to a shortlist so when you go over to your shortlist you can scroll all the way down to the players that have a c rating or below Right now, I've combed out my list to remove all the players that are F and D rated. Those players, I don't really need them. Let me look at this 2023 intake. I have only one player here that is D rated. I can just go ahead to him and ask him or ask to be removed from the list. Just go ahead, remove him from the short list. So you're limiting your list to players that are A plus, A minus and above. Now, the last method I'm about to show you is going to help you find regions that will eventually become Wonder Kid when they turn 19. Now, since the game doesn't show you who these players are, you're going to have to use a tool called Genie Scout. There's Genie Scout for every Football Manager game, but this is currently Genie Scout 24 for Football Manager 2024. You can get Genie Scout any football manager genie scout from fmscout.com i'm going to put a link in the description so you can check out the website and also get the genie scout for yourself but right now i have the game loaded i have my save game loaded in genie scout so what you want to do is to set your league or set the age of the players that you want the age range let's say we want players that that are between 18 years and younger and all you want to do is to first of all go back to your team you need to find a potential ability that actually improves your team. So I'm going to go into my teams or let's say my squad list and then find a player with the highest potential in my squad. Now, this player is Narcis Gaikas. Now, I use this method to actually sign Narcis Gaikas. So he's one of the players that, as you can see, he doesn't even have the media description of Wonder Kid in any way. He's just promising striker, physical, spirited. But I know that he's a Wonder Kid and when he turns 19, he's going to have that tag. So just go over here. Ideally, you would probably not want to put the age at this point. Just find Gaikas. You can search his name here. Or you can do this for any player that you want, really. Did I spell his name wrongly? Yes, I did. It's A-I, not I-A. A-I-X-A-S. So you've got Narcis Gaikas. He's currently playing for Monaco. And Gaikas has a potential ability of 159. So if I want players that are as good as Gaikas and above, I just need to go into my potential and maybe add 150. To 100 and or 150 to 200 and then put this at 15 you got years of age because some regions come in at 15 and then have this up to the age of 19 and then go ahead and press enter guy guys is on the list but i can go ahead and change his name and then just click enter you're going to get a list of players that are currently assigned to clubs or some of them easy to sign you can see this ivanov plamen from bulgaria there's also another player here in maximilian shire i think i tried signing plamen at some point but he didn't want to come to the club so you can go ahead and just double click on the player's name. It's going to show you some of their attributes. So I'm going to find this player in Football Manager. As soon as I know how to spell his name. Maximilian. Maximilian Shareri. What a name. So he's currently at Luzon. And I can just go ahead. I don't know what his price value is right now. But he's assigned to that club. He's currently 15 years old. Just go ahead and make an offer for him. You can see that the value here is two. But whatever losing wants me to pay for him i can just suggest and hear what they want they're asking for seven million and i only have seven million in my budget i assume that depending on the club that you're managing you probably have a lot more than seven million that you can actually go ahead and sign that player so that's how easy it is for you to go ahead and find wonder kids even before they become wonder kids in the game or before they are affiliated to top clubs if you found this video useful remember to leave a like on it and also subscribe to the channel for more football manager tips like this